Shalom, shalom, and welcome back to Kingdom Obedience Ministries. And today's prophetic word is going to be based off of 1 Corinthians 13 and 13. The Lord led me to this scripture last night, and this is what he's speaking in this hour. And now these three and now these three remain faith, hope, and love, but the greatest of these is love. Amen. Love is a universal desire that every human heart craves for. From an infant to the oldest man, we all desire to love and be loved. Love cannot be brought. It's not for sale. It is purely a thing of, of the will. There are four types of love the Father broke down to me. A gate is a sacrificial and unconditional love. A gate accepts people for who they are regardless of their flaws, shortcomings, or faults. This love is a decision you make to love a person even though you may not like them. It's all about sacrifice as well as giving and accepting nothing in return. It is a choice you make to be committed to a person or people as demonstrated by your behavior towards them. The second is philia. Love is affectionate or brotherly love. It's a tender or warm love towards a friend. Storgage love is family and friendship love. It's the natural love of parents to children or between family members. It's unconditional, accepts flaws and faults, and helps you to easily forgive. It's sacrificial, committed, and makes you feel comfortable, secure, and safe. Eros is a passionate, romantic love. It's simply an emotional love because humans' emotions and feelings are never stable. They're affected by situations, circumstances, hormonal imbalance, etc. Among these four levels of love, a gave is the most difficult to experience and to express. Humans are incapable of expressing a gave love unless helped by God. This is why a gave love is only found among Christians. It is poured out in our hearts at the point of salvation in a seed form. It requires nurturing and constant practice for it to be mature to the point where it can be expressed. We know genuine Christians have the agape love of God in them, but why do we find it hard to show this love ourselves? Understanding the components of agape love and the obstacles to practicing this love is the key to unlocking our abilities to practice it. When we understand the components and study how to overcome the obstacles to loving God's way, backed up by prayers, the body of Christ will be able to fully demonstrate God's love to one another and to the world at large. Family. What the Father is saying in this hour is that he desires for us to have the agape love, loving one another unconditionally, um, loving your enemies, loving your community, loving just everyone in this world like Jesus did when he was on this earth. Um, the Father is just wanting to express love. And not even just today, but every single day, family, we as Christians have to be able to walk in love every day 365 days a year and so forth we have to be able to express love no matter what when we in the grocery store express love like love people have to see love in us you know just like they have to see god in us we have to be able to express the love and be able to just pour into people you know you never know what someone's going through family um and the father is just very adamant about love and being able to just express love and giving back to people in love you know because that's what it is about because God is love you know and the way he broke this down to me in the in the four different types of love a gate is the number one that we need to apply in our lives family um so just take heed to this word thank you for watching kisses God bless you God loves you and I love you shalom